Hi, let's see how to create a circular image in Elementor and CSS using aspect ratio. Use an image widget to create basically your image. Choose image and place your image here. I will set this image size to full and go to the advanced panel of your image widget. If you're using Elementor Pro, you will find the custom CSS field at the bottom. So let's type here selector and a tag image or IMG. Now the first thing I will do is that I will, I will set the width to something smaller so that we can see what we are doing. So I will type width and let's say 400 pixels. Now I will type aspect ratio and set this to 1. Basically aspect ratio 1 means that you are creating a square. But as you can see uh, this distorts our image so it doesn't keep actually the original proportions. So in order to keep uh, the ratio, we want to put, uh, this is the key thing, object fit set to cover. And now you can see that it, it is not uh, unnaturally stretched, so it keeps, its natural, it keeps its natural proportions. So the key point here is object fit cover. And basically what we want to do next is to set border radius to 50%. Of course, if you want to keep a, uh, your image square, you don't need to use border radius, but the logic is same for both uh, square and circular images. So you keep the aspect ratio to 1, object fit to cover, and you just use border radius 50% if you want to make it a, cir a circle. You can just simply set the width to whatever you want, for example, 200 pixels or let's say 600 pixels. And there you go, you have a circular image using a few simple lines of CSS. Now, if you don't use Elementor Pro, then you can basically, let me just remove this code here. You can go to layout and set your CSS class here. So I will call this uh, image round or let's say image circle. You don't use the dot here, so just give it a plain name, remember it and click on update. Now I'm using custom CSS and JavaScript plugin, which uh, basically the link for it you can find in the description. I will type here dot image circle because that is the name, uh, that is a class name that I assigned to my image. Then I will type image, IMG, so that I know that I'm applying these changes to an image element. And I will basically type the same code uh, as previously, so aspect ratio I will set to 1, width I will set to something like, let's say, 300 pixels, and object fit I will set to cover. Let's say that this time I don't want to make my image a circle, I will just keep it a square so I won't apply the border radius. Uh, set, uh, let's click update here and see what how our page looks like. I will refresh it and you can see that the same changes are applied even if you you can use the same code even if you're not using Elementor Pro but the free version. Now keep in mind that uh, basically with what you can do with this aspect ratio is not necessarily a square image. You can set this to any number, you can set this to 2 so to a value that's higher than 1 or to a value that's lower than 1. So basically, let me just delete this code here so that it's easier for us to see what we are doing directly in Elementor Pro. I will just use the same code I used previously and just paste it here. Uh, let's, let me just delete the border radius for now. And if I want to set the aspect, the aspect ratio to something like Two, as you can see, it will create basically a wide image. If I set it to less than 1, let's say 0 0.5, it will create this kind of long, slim uh, image. But basically, you can set this value to anything you want, and as long as you keep the object fit to cover, it won't distort the image itself. So there you go. I hope you like this video. If you have, don't forget to like, comment, or subscribe.